ultimately that is what this is about. The mission, San Francisco, are ultimately, ultimately about love. The ruling that the United States Supreme Court issued beyond the legalese basically says that love is supreme. And love is supreme tonight. Love is supreme. So with that, it is my honor to call upon a number of people who are here today to speak. And I'd like to begin by calling on the director of the incredible organization that has been around for so long that is responsible for this beautiful art, the, exec the director of Galeria de la Raza, Annie Rivera. Thank you, thank you Galeria, thank you to this community for your strength, for your patience, for your love. Annie Rivera. Hi everyone, bear with me. It's so lovely to see all of you. Um, I wrote it down and I have to read it or else my emotions will make the best of me because it's been a tough time. So, here we go. Uh, it's not working for me. Okay. On behalf of the staff and board of Galeria de la Raza, I would like to sincerely thank all of you for being here. Um, every single one of your words of encouragement, your volunteered hours, your donations, have just allowed us to think this through, to heal, to, to begin the thought of healing through all the actions that we've lived in the last couple of weeks. We would like to thank those that have outreached to us with your you know, concerns. Um, we feel that through peaceful dialogue, through the arts, the letters, the conversations, are all our mediums which we can have constructive community building. Y en este momento se ve y se siente. Can all of you raise your signs right now? Galeria's mission is to serve as a laboratory where artists can explore contemporary issues in art, culture, and civic society, and to advance an intercultural dialogue. In doing so, and as a community-based organization, we have had the honor to present work, not only from the Mission District, from many artists throughout the state of California, on a national level, and in many cases, international communities. Galeria is still committing, committed to supporting Chicano Latino artists that speak to the wealth of the perspectives of our own people. And it, it is in that spirit that we invited the Maricón Collective to present the Por Vida mural. The targeted violence that has been visited upon the mural through violent actions and violent rhetoric on social media send a message that queer Chicanos do not exist. But I'm here to tell you, we do exist. We've been here and we've worked in this community. Galeria in the 70s, you know, we've been, work, we've been supporting LGBT artwork that speaks about that visibility. The spray paint effacements and the image burning make it clear that further dialogue is needed in our communities, that the issues must continue to evolve, that we must continue to engage. Inciting fear and causing destruction can only cause further displacement. And now more than ever, we must continue to stay united. The mission must come together to retain our history and our cultural spaces. We believe that it's only through unity that our healing can begin to process and happen. It is in these challenging times that we must exercise patience, work together through these events, the good and the bad, through our emotions, through the rebuilding process. And it is because of Galeria's legacy to 
provide a home for many artists, activists, civic leaders that have built a space for us to imagine and reimagine and realize the possibilities of our people that we must protect. Today's rally, I want to focus on a call for peace, for the de-escalation of violence, for healing, and for the protection of the spiritual and physical space that we're at. However, I also know our own capacity does not allow, this, allow us, Galeria, to do this work alone. And so I really am here to reach out to every single one of you to talk to your neighbors, talk to your family members, your friends, the people standing next to you, and figuring out how we're going to do this together. This is just the beginning of the conversation for us. We will continue the dialogue. We are scheduling a community forum conversation. And so again, I ask for your patience while we really thoughtfully plan it, you know, get all the details as best as we can organized. And we also invite you to continue to send us your, your thoughts, your notes, whatever it is that you think we're missing. And for now, I want to leave it there. I want to thank you. And again, one more time, at uh, the count of three, we're going to raise our, our posters and we're all going to say por vida. Ready? One, two, three. Por vida! Thank you, Annie. That was beautiful. Por vida. Por vida. Next, I want to call uh, another incredible leader in this community. Uh,